Good day everyone. What a glorious morning on the Swan. It's um yeah, wind is forecast for a little later, but at the moment it's just glorious. So I'm gonna get the kayak on the water. I won't waste too much time. I'm gonna head over towards the bridge. Just over here. I'll go for a bit of a cruise later. Uh, let's just get out there and see what happens, eh? Hoping to find a few Taylor. Let's get into it. Glorious conditions. I love it like this. Best part of the day. Sun just about to come up. No one else around. Just love it. The advantage of uh, getting up early on a Sunday morning, I guess. Right, eh? First plan. I'm going to. I can untie this hook. There it is. First plan is I'm going to have a quick little uh, spin under the bridge there. Drag a double clutch around. See if I can grab a, a tailor from under the bridge. That'd be nice. And uh, yeah, we'll take it from there, see what happens. So let's get that double clutch in the water and uh, start trolling. What a glorious morning. Hope the wind holds off. And the rain, there's a bit of rain around. Well, that current's pumping under here. I can feel it pushing me very firmly back this way. Oh well, here we go. Oh yeah, that current's ripping under there. I'm gonna fly back through going the other way. Like I caught it because that rod was coming out of the rod holder then. And okay, we got a fish. I'm just going to pull up river a bit because that current's going to drag me back towards the bridge very rapidly. He come off just there. Lost him. Oh well, let's do another couple of passes under there because there's obviously fish around. I'm just not good enough to catch them. Okay, a bit quieter than I thought. One hit on the first pass underneath here, and then nothing. Been a few passes since, but uh, I will keep at it for a little while, but I might. Might think about cruising on somewhere else actually. Do a few more passes under the bridge, see what happens. I really thought I would have bagged one under there. But oh well. Just nice to be out here, I guess. Right, eh? one more pass under the bridge and then we'll start cruising around. Okay, no tailor at the bridge. Let's go for a run. Okay, see what we can find up river or down river actually from here.
Dead quiet. Nothing happening at all. Can't see any birds gathering anywhere. Not a single touch since that one at the bridge. Gee, it's a tough morning. Uh, southwest is just starting to creep in too so I'm not going to hang around for that so hopefully we can get a fish before the wind starts really springing up tough morning oh well alright I finally spotted some birds doing their thing but they're way off in the distance over there but uh, oh well, I'm not doing anything else so might as well cruise up that way, eh? Let's go. Surely I get a fish at some point. Yeah, they're still quite a ways off. This is about the time of I wish I had a tinny so I could just whiz over there. Just Gun it over there and get into where the fish are. There's always a danger in the kayak. By the time you get there, everything's shut down. But, uh, oh well. I've got plenty of hard bag to wear off, so let's get over there. All right. We're almost up to them now. It's been pretty frustrating. They've actually been um, moving away from me as I've been approaching them. <laughs> So I've been chasing them for a while, but there's definitely fish working there. So I'm pretty confident. It's been a tough start in the morning, but uh, I reckon I'm about to get a few fish. Let's put a cast in. There we go, we're on. Had to happen sooner or later. All the way to the boat, please. Let me get one fish to the boat this morning. Looks like it's going to be undersized, but that's uh, not all that surprising, to be honest. Let's have a look at you. Yeah, small fish. But, uh, yeah. We got a fish. Alright, he's unhooked himself even better. There he is. Little chopper. Off you go, buddy. <laughs> well, that was an effort. It's a long way to go for a tiny chopper, but oh well. Good fun. Now, yeah, what are these birds doing? Just um, put in a few casts here, I think. That might be the go. Yep, there's one.
on my old uh, my ancient Silstar first rod I ever got my birthday when I was about 10 years old which makes a rod 43 years old hey still oh, that one will be closer but still undersized All right, mate. All right. Let's sort you out. I need the pliers for this one. Off you go, mate. Then I drop him. Or is it just a tiny fish? Yeah, just a tiny fish. Or is he swimming at me? Swimming at me is the biggest one so far. Still undersized though. But, uh, oh well, cool. We're getting a few fish at last. Off you go, mate. Oh, yeah, they're on. It's only a school of small fish, but yep, they're definitely on. This one's swimming at me too. <laughs> oh, drop, no, no, he's still there. I thought I dropped him in there for a second. Great fun. Cool, off you go. I'd like a bigger one, but it doesn't really matter. It's all good fun. You never know when a big one's going to turn up though. that one on the tape. Probably still not quite there I reckon. Let's get that hook out of here mate. You don't want that. Off you go. Cool. <laughs> oh, I'm already Already over the moon. That's uh, what's that? Three or four fish. Bit of an effort to paddle over here, but uh, oh well, it's always worth the effort if you're getting something in reward. Just got to keep up with the school. There they go. Another miss. <laughs> and a hit. 
Got him that time. Be a better fish. This might be my keeper. Giving a better account of himself. Yeah, that's my keeper. I reckon that's a that's a 30 for sure, for sure. We'll measure him of course though. Yeah, good fish, good fish. Easy, 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 30, shade under 34. Cool, all right, got a keeper. And there's still plenty around me by the sound of it, so let's keep at it. I love these little nomad lures, that's, that's only a 20 gram lure and that's punching way out there. Even on my ancient Silstar. Yep, there we go. And the single treble on the back of the metals is much easier to deal with than a lure with two trebles on it too. Much better way of fishing. What's this, about half a dozen fish so far? Slow start, it's turned into a great morning. Yeah, we'll let this one go. He won't be quite there. There you go, buddy. It's often like this with Taylor in the river, you take forever to find them, but once you find them, you get a red hot session. Might not last very long, but uh, oh well, you make the most of it while it's happening, I guess. Well, this could be the first lure I've retrieved all the way to the boat in a while. It is, as it shut down just like that. Birds aren't hitting the water either. Oh, here we go, right there. Well, it certainly can shut down just like that. Oh, missed him. Got him that time. Just be another reasonable fish. Wow, putting a good a good account of himself. I mean I'm only using very light gear, but oh yeah, that's a ripper. That's a good fish. Let's get that in the net.
Oh, are you kidding? Oh, mate. Mate. That was a great fish. That was a good fish. Bugger. Oh, well. <laughs> good fun, though. I was, I was just about to say that I find I always pin fish better on these uh, single trebles at the back of, of the metal lures instead of the double clutch. I'm never 100% sure of landing one on the double clutch, but uh, well, I guess I'm never 100% sure of landing one on any lure, am I? And look at that, just like that, birds are gone. Birds are all gone. Cast and hope. There's rain coming too, so. All right, one more fish before I go. Swimming at me, swimming straight at me. I'm gonna get wet. It's raining pretty heavily over there. Oh, got away again. Okay, two in a row. <sighs> what am I gonna do about this rain? One more cast. This is like, this is it, last cast. As you can see over there, there's a bit of rain heading my way. And I don't particularly want to get caught out here in the middle of that. Oh, there we go. This might be the last fish. Although, <laughs> I can almost guarantee you I'm going to sit here and keep casting. Yeah, I'm uh, shame I missed that. That one before, that was a ripper. He would have been nudging 40, I reckon. Well, this might be a good one too. Oh, what? What's going on? I've just gone to... I've just gone to... Uh, I better not say what I've gone to. It's just gotten really difficult for me. <laughs> oh well, yeah, one more cast. There they are. They're right there in front of me now. Yep, the bird spotted them too. It's worth another cast. I'm gonna get wet, but oh well. Oh, well, I hit him in the boat. I landed that one. <laughs> Not very convincingly, but I'll take it. Some anti-reverse on this reel is a bit uh, hit and miss. Here's another one. Oh, <laughs> you love that sound. Come on, it'll be close, probably just under, we'll let this one go. There he is, off you go mate. 
Well, I might be lucky actually. The rain looks like it's gonna creep past that way. Might not, might not get me. So maybe staying here and having a few more casts was the right call. Maybe. <laughs> on this one. This one looks like it could be a keeper. Whoa! Yeah, that end of reverse is shot. This is a good fish. Oh, what? What? Now, you can only laugh, I suppose. Destroyed. Good thing I've got one in the in the kayak already to keep. Come on, man, I'm getting slaughtered out here. What's going on? Well, just like that, seems to have shut down. So, anyway, I've had a great morning on the water so far. So what I'm gonna do is, I think I might just start heading back, start trolling lures back now. I've caught heaps of fish. I've had a great morning. I've got one in the back of the kayak here to keep. So yeah, let's, uh, might troll that way actually. There's a couple of birds there, so, I'll troll that way and then head back to the ute. It's been a great morning on the water so far. Hopefully I can pick up one or two more fish before I call it a day. Well, there was a school of fish here, as you can tell by the birds, but there's a dolphin just in here somewhere. Oh, hang on, I'm on here. Just gonna say there's a dolphin in here somewhere. I reckon he would scare the fish off, but oh, well, I've hooked one up, so. There's a dolphin over there. Hope you don't show interest in the fish I've hooked. Nice. Nice 
huge probably undersized but uh oh well that's okay let's get this other lure in there's a dolphin better fisherman than i'll ever be Try that again. Off you go, mate. Watch out for the dolphin. There he is. Oh, two of them. Cool. All right. I don't know how the fishing's going to go here then. Anyway, it's cool to see him. Plenty of rain that way too. Maybe I should just sit here for a minute. Nice and clear over here. Good. Birds over there, but those dolphins are still over there too. So I don't really want to get in their way so I might just spin around and head this way try and get around the back of this rain I don't particularly want to paddle back through that so I'll paddle that way for a little while troll a lure that way might get in behind it might Okay, well there it is. That's um, pretty much the session over, I think. Um, of course, I'll troll some lures on the way back, but uh, yeah, it seems to have shut down as it often does. But, uh, anyway, what what started as a very slow, uh, kind of dead session that really heated up there for a minute it was turned into a red hot session. Uh, these couple of those fish they were I reckon pushing 40 and they taught me a lesson they were smarter than me um, fortunately I got that that reasonable one that I wanted to say he was just under 34 but uh, yeah a couple of those ones I dropped I reckon would have pushed 40 but I'll never know because I dropped them I wasn't good enough but uh, what a great morning on the water anyway thanks for coming fishing with me guys Tight lines. Gee, I'm looking forward to the <coughs> Taylor over the summer season on the swan. Tight lines. See you next time.